Hi guys. Uh, welcome to another video. This time it's a bit different. I guess we'll start going over the applications I use for Hyperland. And the first one is NG Displays. So this guy allows you to deal with your displays, to line them up the way you need them to, to set your uh, refresh rate, okay? And to do anything else that you need to do, because eventually I hope they add HDR support you know, SDR brightness, SDR saturation, uh, color management enable button. I'm able to do that, but I made a mock-up as well. But it would be cool if they did that, you know? So here it is, your little manual for everything you need, set your size, all of this. There's also this drop down, and it's pretty simple. It saves uh, to dot config. I just noticed that this window is more oh no it's the border that's causing it to be gapped never mind it saves in here right it will save into monitors and uh if you open this up you'll notice there it is everything's in there and you can just take this and you can copy this wherever you need to but i've changed my hyperlens so that this is where my monitors are handled and i did that by i believe it's in here I believe we added it in here. Yes, right here. Source of monitors right here at the very, very top. That way it will override everything else. So if you need to do that, you can add that to your hyperlin.conf. And every time you set your monitors here, it will set your monitors system wide. It makes life really, really, really easy. I know it's not the longest video in the world, but you can drag these around. You can do whatever you need to, right? As long as they're just together like this everything is good you know so this is this monitor right here this is the dell and this is the 1440p 1080 hertz and this is the uh the same monitor as this one the only difference is it's on hdmi because 9070 owners are screwed over and we only have two display ports instead of three and one hdmi NVIDIA is very lucky with this uh, for a lot of reasons because, well, they have more HDMI, they have more display ports, and that means my monitor will never run at its full uh, 180 hertz. It's not the most annoying thing in the world. I mean, I can get 4K out of it, but it's still kind of a letdown. I will be trying to plug the monitor, though into my my 4070. I wonder if that will work. Uh, because I would like to have all the monitors at the, at the same hertz. I just realized I could probably do that. Anyway, I hope this video helped you. This will allow setting up multi-monitors or even just under your refresh rate or anything monitor related super easy within your config. Because then you can just copy and paste it over and you're done. You don't have to do any math or any weird commands in the terminal you just open up the application and go hope it helps if it does let me know in the comments below uh, if you're new here subscribe if you want to help support me in any way check the description there's membership on youtube and there's ko-fi for donations bye everybody